Hello everyone, in this video I will be showing you how to burn a DVD using Amersoft Video Converter Ultimate. This guide will take you through step by step on how to easily burn a DVD to ISO format. You can also burn high resolution videos to Blu-ray discs on your Windows PC. Part 1. Burn the videos to DVD. Step 1 in this process is to load the videos inside the DVD burner. Once you've opened Video Converter Ultimate, what you want to do is go into the Burn tab, and then you can click on the Open button, and then we can either load our DVD or add our files from here. So what we can do is go ahead and load up my ISO DVD files that I have. And now that we have it selected, we can choose whether we want the main movie or all the movies. If you want, you can also convert con already converted videos inside of your Converted tab, um, but in this case we're just going to use this ISO DVD file. Step 2 is to choose a DVD template over here on the right side. Video Converter Ultimate includes many DVD templates to create awesome DVD menus and navigation screens. So to change the template we simply just need to click on the arrows and you can see there's a lot of cool presets to choose from already. And if we want to we can go in further and click on the edit button to customize the menu a little bit more. We can select a few more and even download them directly here. So once we found one we liked, we can just click on OK and now move on to adjusting some more options. Step 3 is to change the settings located below our preset we've just set up. So what we can do is choose if we want no menu or a custom menu. We can choose the aspect ratio, whether it's NTSC or a PAL standard, as well as the overall quality of our DVD. Step 4. Finally, we can burn our videos to a DVD. To do this, we just need to select where we want to burn the DVDs to. In this case, we have a couple options. And of course, you'll need to insert a blank DVD disc into your computer before you do this. Then simply click on the burn icon, and this will begin the process. If you don't have a disc around, you can also burn videos to a DVD folder or ISO file. Part 2. Burn DVD to ISO or DVD folder. Step 1 in burning a DVD to a folder is to load our DVD again, so I'll click on my option to load whichever kind of file I have, and click on OK to accept. Step 2 is again to select a template for our DVD, so we can go through and select one, adjust things like the options, the aspect ratio, we can go in and adjust the templates and check out new ones. Step 3 is to again adjust our DVD settings, such as the aspect ratio, PAL or NTSC standard, as well as the quality of our DVD. And step 4 is that we can finally start to burn our DVD to an ISO or DVD folder. To do this we can just select which kind of burning we want to do down here, and click on burn. Thanks for watching this video, and we will see you next time.